I'm in Kansas City, Missouri, visiting some family, and I can't resist a good stream. Now, the limestone here is 295 million years old, and there is a fossilized clam. And I see fossils everywhere in this stream. Look at that. Just fossils everywhere. All right, there's another little shell right here. Beautiful. This limestone you see around is 295 million years old. It's absolutely ancient. Just in the middle of a neighborhood. Look at that limestone. The stream just cutting right through it. It's incredible to think that this was all ocean bottom and now it's thousands of miles from the sea. Look at that. That is coral in Missouri. And you see that little circle? That is a crinoid stem, or also known as a sea lily, also known as the ancestor to modern day starfish. This limestone is full of beautiful fossils. Just by paying close attention, there you can see, there's another crinoid stem, right, right there. Look at that little crinoid stem. What is this? I have no clue what this is. Let me wash that off really quick. Down in the stream. Oh, that's freezing. That is, oh. Must be some like reddish quartzite. That's really pretty. Right there in the center, is a nice little turtle I saw. He's kind of hiding underneath the leaves. The moment he saw me, he went to scramble for cover. I've gone about as far as I can in this stream without getting wet. And I look down in this pile. What's right here? A pretty decent sized crinoid stem. 300 million years old. That's wonderful. There's another clamshell. It's a whole clamshell. It's been waiting to be touched for 300 million years. Perfect condition. I'm walking down to this little gravel bar. And what do I come across? A dinosaur. That's an ancient find. That's really cool looking, honestly. I thought this rock right here was an odd one. So I grabbed it, lifted it up, only to see, I think it's a bone? It looks like it might be a bone. <laughs> it's hollow. Whatever it is, it has a lot of marks on it. I'm gonna leave it, because I don't know what that is. And, that's okay, it can stay there. Here's another quartzite. These things are interesting. I might have to take this home and tumble it up since it's really quite sparkly and clear. What's incredible is there's so much natural history everywhere. It doesn't matter where you are. It doesn't matter where you live. A stream by your home, anywhere, can be full of treasures. You're always surrounded by natural history. We live in such a beautiful world.